This video demonstrates the process of decoding RS-232 signals and measuring data transfer speed using an oscilloscope. The scope probe is connected to the RS-232 transmit pin on the board. After power up, the code in the microcontroller will continue to send a TechLab string through the RS-232 transmit pin every 5 milliseconds. Open the protocol decoding menu on the oscilloscope. Select RS-232 decoder. Set the parameters as follows. Baud rate, 115,200. Word length, 7. Stop bit, 1. Parity mode, odd. Ensure that the parameters match the RS-232 configuration parameters used in the microcontroller code. Then enable decoding in the menu. As you see, the decoded string TechLab appears on the oscilloscope. The event table displays the decoded data and the corresponding time in table format. To transmit a single character using the settings in this experiment, it requires 10 bits, 7 data bits, 1 start bit, 1 stop bit, and 1 parity bit. At a baud rate of 115,200, it will take approximately 87 microseconds to send a single character. The string TechLab consists of 9 characters, including 7 alphanumeric characters plus a new line in carriage return, so it will take approximately 783 microseconds to send the full string. When measuring the time on the oscilloscope using two measuring cursors, it shows approximately 822 microseconds for the string transmission, averaging about 91 microseconds per character. Alternatively, you can use the time data in the event table for calculation, revealing approximately 94 microseconds per character. In general, the observed transmission time is slightly longer than the calculated transmission time due to various overheads and practical considerations. The difference range can vary, in our case, it is typically within a few microseconds. Additionally, measure the interval between two RS-232 data transmissions. It is approximately 5.18 milliseconds, closely matching the 5 millisecond delay setting in the code. If you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing for more content like this. Thank you for watching.